afternoon. Hello. I'm with Taylor. Hey. It is Sunday, a sunny Sunday, Beautiful not a cloud Sunday. in the sky in Los Angeles, and we are going to meet Marissa Lace for some lunch. I actually woke up so early this morning, like I don't know what's wrong with me. We barely got any sleep last night. We went to sleep at like four, but I woke up at like 8.30. And I didn't go back to sleep, which is so weird. We were like, let's go get some lunch and let's have a great day. We're gonna go actually to Spellbound Sky. Maybe I'll try I'll vlog in there for you guys. We're heading to Men what, how do you pronounce it? Mendocino, Mendocino Farms. Farms. Mendocino Farms by the Grove for lunch with Marissa. I've never been here, but I have heard great things. So we're gonna check it out. Hello. So now oh we God. have coming in hot Tokyo. We have yeah. met up with <laughs> Marissa. Shalom. Hi. Oh, oh. And um, we are going right now. We are in Silver Lake and we are going to Spellbound Sky, which is the uh, I think I was telling you guys Yeah, it's like the spirituality and crystal store that I was I was literally here in a vlog like a week ago And Marissa and Taylor have never been so I'm taking them because they want to go and I'm excited and it's gonna be great And I'll try to get some footage in there um, if they let me I think they will they're so nice Let's do it Spellbound Sky. I got a little bit of footage in there. It was amazing. I got my mom a Mother's Day present that I'm gonna send to her and I will show well I was gonna say I'll show it to you guys, but they packaged it up and everything so my mom will film a haul. My mom will film a haul for you. Oh my god, what if I asked my mom to send me a clip of her opening it and I put it in the vlog? Like I can do a Mother's Day because I'm not gonna be with my mom on my I wish I could, but it's in a week, I won't be home. But I am going home. I haven't told you guys this, I don't think. I am going home on May 18th. Yeah, anyway, we had a great time. Did you guys like it? I had the time of my life. It was Taylor and Marissa's. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm Taylor's like, what's going on? It was Taylor and Marissa's first time there, so. Amazing. Amazing, Marissa. Amazing. Now we are just, um, I'm honestly really tired, so I might get, grab a coffee. We're going to run into Barnes & Noble, and then we are going to have, just finish our days off, you know, doing our own stuff our own things because we all got stuff to get done me personally my things that I have to get done is be have a lazy day you know but Taylor on the other hand she's got some stuff to do all right yeah, so homework. I'm gonna do some cleaning and dream board I'm gonna make oh, I need same. to make a dream board wait, we, oh, dream wait. Board party? we need to do that together together I'm a dream together board party tonight but I will make a second dream board okay we okay. are having a dream board party this week I'm Let's looking do it. Well, hello, long time no talk. Today has just been like a lazy bum day. Like, I took like a three hour nap, which wasn't intentional, but I think I was telling you guys earlier, like, I barely got any sleep last night. I don't know why I randomly woke up at like 8.30 a.m. on a Sunday, like what? I just took a nap and I've just literally been chilling. I edited and exported um, my vlog for the past two days. I combined footage from Friday and Saturday and I, I'm glad that I did that because it turned out to be like a 14 minute vlog as opposed to two like six, seven minute vlogs. And I think you guys will just like it better because Friday I didn't get that much footage. I'm exporting that now, but you guys, what I was watching and what I need to finish watching before I took my nap was my date with the president's daughter, a Disney Channel original, prime Disney Channel right here, you guys. Like, if you have seen this movie, you need to talk about it. It is so great. The pink velour dress is my everything. It's in nine parts, and I found it on YouTube. But, um... It's not missing any of it like it's really it really easily goes together but this the quality is 240p because it was uploaded in 2009 so it's not the best quality but I was still really enjoying I was telling Marissa and Taylor this but I just felt so off all day like I I don't know I think like there's a full moon and like I, fe I feel the power of the full moon a lot as weird as that sounds but I also feel just like off 
Like, it just felt weird today. Today was a really good day. I'm so glad I got to go to Spellbound Sky, and I need to ship out my mom's present probably tomorrow. I'm getting a spray tan tomorrow, which is very exciting because I am so pale right now, and I'm going to a new place that I've never been to, so we will do that tomorrow. I am just hanging out and talking nonsense. Like, I don't even know what I'm saying to you guys anymore, so I am probably going to just, like, chill for the rest of the night. I don't think I'm going to get out of the vlog right now, but I'm not going to probably do anything for the rest of the night, so I'll be ending it probably here in, like, an hour or two. So I am just chilling in my bed still. I did have some social interaction. Megan and Maddie got home. They were out all day, so I was home um, alone. And they also brought over their friend KR because they were doing a photo shoot with him today. I just made my list for tomorrow. Well, I started it, like I like start it the night before and then as the day like progresses, I like check things off and like add when I know like what time I'm gonna like be working out and stuff, like I'll add that in. But look, the other night Drew put this on the I am grateful for section, which is just adorable. And then Lexi put this love those kiddos so yeah started our list for tomorrow and i'm also watching a ted talks and i've seen this one like four times you guys have to see this ted talks i will put the link in the description box it is called how to stop screwing yourself over it's not, that sounds like really harsh i'm like what does that even mean but like give it like two minutes like this lady is a, a little bit like intense and kind of like tough love but this ted talks when i watched it like it gives you so much like motivation it just makes you like if you need like productivity or you want something and you want to get something done like you need to watch this ted talks because seriously like it will just make you like wake up and you'll be like holy crap like that lady is is so right i don't know i feel like it would relate a bit more if you're like my age ish or older like if you're younger you might watch this and be like like why did Lindsay tell me to watch that this day a few weeks ago or maybe it was a while ago i was watching a bunch of ted talks and i came across this one it has like millions of views i think i think it has like at least 2 million views yeah it has 2.5 million views and it's by um this i think she's a inspirational speaker or something mel robbins is her name anyway i'm gonna link it in the description box and you guys should just watch it because it's awesome but i wanted to end the vlog now because i am going to sleep i'm getting a spray tan as i told you guys i think i'm also gonna get my nails done and i'm gonna try and take a shower before before that yeah because i need to i feel like i need to shave my legs before the spray tan because they're so like uh prickly ew i hate pr my prickly legs ah shaving is so annoying um oh by the way thank you guys for your comments on my vlog when i asked you about the razor blades because you guys told me first of all that i should be using men's razor blades because they work better and my mom used to tell me that and for some reason i was just like men's razor blades why would i do that so i just kept buying like the girl ones but apparently like men's ones like all you so many of you guys were saying like they work better and you get a closer shave and thank you to all of you guys who told me i should um check out dollar shave club because I had heard about that actually from one of my teachers and it, we learned about it in school and I didn't even realize that like you could I mean I guess it's mostly for men but like one of the razors I was on the website and one of the razors was like your girlfriend can use this too so I was like honestly like it's a razor like guys and girls can use this I think I joined or I at least got like the first month of dollar shave club so that's exciting we're gonna try that out it's basically if you guys haven't heard of it it's this company that delivers you four new razor blades in a little box to your your door every month and you change them out every week so it's like you don't have to like be constantly buying razor blades and I think it's gonna work out well because I really don't change mine enough you guys I probably change mine like every like four or three weeks and like I guess that's not good so anyway thank you for that this is a long ending clip to the day I hope you guys enjoyed give this video a thumbs up if you did and I am excited for this week it is gonna be an amazing week and I will see you guys tomorrow good night goodbye